Okay, let's do a really, really easy SFC project just to make sure that you're comfortable working with it and you can basically get done anything you're going to need to do in there. The first thing we want to do is we want to make sure that we have a three-step sequence. So we can call those step one, step two, step three. And I'm just saying that to keep everything consistent so that I'm not always saying the second step, the third step, and then we're all trying to guess at the names. It really doesn't matter what you call them, but I'm just calling them step one, step two, step three to make it easy. Anyway, what we're going to do is from step one, we want to automatically transition to step two after 10 seconds. Once we're in step two, we want to stay there for at least 10 seconds, but we don't want to transition to step three until we manually close a bool. So we're going to have a bool which is going to represent maybe a switch or a button or something like that. And until we make that true, we're not going to go into step three. Once we do and we get to step three, we want to be there for 10 seconds as well. And after that 10 seconds, we want to automatically transition back to either step one or step two. And what's going to make the difference is going to be the state of another bool. So we're going to have another bool inside of this step. And think of that like a toggle or a selector switch. If it's in one state, then we're going to go to step one. If it's in the other state, we're going to go to step two. And it doesn't really matter which state that thing is assigned to. So if off is one or off is two, doesn't matter. You're in full control of that. So let's try to do that. And then as one bonus, we're going to go ahead and put an exit action onto step two. And we're going to make that a counter. So every time we exit step two, we want to assign a counter to that step, which is going to count for us how many times we actually leave step two. So that's it. That's your mission should you choose to accept it. And after you have yours working, I'll show you how I do mine. See you then.